It seems like almost every month this year, Microsoft has released another product under the Copilot banner, and I feel like it's getting a little bit confusing for some. So in today's video, I wanna look at all the different products that are co-branded as Microsoft Copilot to give you a better understanding about what these products are and what their intended uses are as well. We're gonna go through these products in the chronological order when they're announced or released to hopefully add a little bit more structure as well to this video. Of course, if you do find this video useful, let me know by giving a thumbs up and if you're in a supercharged way as your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. With that being said, let's get into this. First up, we have GitHub Copilot that was released and announced in November 2022. And it is available starting at $10 per user per month. But of course, there are business uh, editions that are a bit more expensive and there are student editions that are free while you're a student. GitHub Copilot is an AI-powered coding tool that assists developers in writing codes by suggesting the next line and turns natural language prompts into code suggestions based on the project's context and the style. Its target audience is developers with the goal of helping them write code faster and more efficiently. At present, about 30 to 40% of all the code on GitHub has been AI assisted. And I feel with a product like GitHub Copilot, that is just gonna increase as time goes on and the product gets even better. Next, we have Microsoft Dynamics 365 Copilot that was announced in March, 2023. And it is an extension of the Dynamics 365 platform. It's embedded in the entire customer journey from your CRM and your ERP. Um, and it's an extension to Dynamics 365, uh, especially with the sales integration in Outlook and Dynamics 365 standalone. It does some amazingly handy things like generate communication emails with your customers. It gives you AI generated summaries of your meetings and it also provides you customer insights. It gives you information around marketing and so, so much more. Dynamics 365 is really for any organization wanting to improve the customer journey from end to end. And it is a tool that really, I think when you use it inside your organization, your team just love using it. If you're looking at buying a Microsoft Sales Copilot, which is a part of Dynamics 365 Copilot, you're looking at $40 USD per user per month. But of course, there are different ways of getting access to different areas of Dynamics 365 Copilot, depending on your level of Microsoft licensing. One product I'm super keen on is Microsoft Security Copilot that was announced in March of 2023 and starts rolling out in December of 2023. Microsoft Security Copilot is designed for any organization, large or small, to help you increase the speed and security around your tenancy. Microsoft Security Copilot aims to increase the efficiencies and the capabilities of products like Microsoft Defender and the Defender Suite to improve security outcomes at machine speed and scale. It is going to improve the way you secure your overall organization and reduce the overheads that come with the cost of security. I can't find the different pricing for Microsoft Defender Copilot right now, but I'm sure it will also depend on the level of Microsoft 365 licenses that you do have. April of 2023, Microsoft announced Copilot in Microsoft Viva that is rolling out starting 2024, and it is designed to bring aspects of AI into the human resources part of any organization. It is designed to help all organizations by simplifying goal setting, improve engagement and communication throughout the organization. Copilot in Microsoft Fever is set to be released in 2024 and we'll get more information about the product as we get closer to the release date. In August of 2023, we saw Microsoft Bing Chat Enterprise, which is built into Microsoft Edge and is powered by a number of AI tools such as ChatGPT. The difference between Microsoft Bing Chat and Microsoft Bing Chat Enterprise is that the Enterprise Edition secures your organization's information. It still has access to the ChatGPT engine and all the information from it, but anything that your organization and your employees input into it doesn't get exposed to the World Wide Web, which means there's no potential of data leakage to anything outside of your organization. Microsoft Bing Chat Enterprise is designed to allow organizations and employees to use tools like ChatGPT, but make sure that the organization data stays secure. Bing Chat Enterprise was rebranded as Microsoft Copilot in November of 2023 and is available to organizations with an M365 business standard or above licensing uh, for free and it will be released in future for $5 per user per month as a standalone tool. November of 2023 also saw the announce and the release of Windows 11 Copilot which is free and was pushed down to Windows 11 devices with an update. Uh, and it is designed to help get users familiar with using an AI tool on the desktop. Windows 
11 Copilot is essentially bringing in that Bing Chat or Bing Chat Enterprise to the desktop with a few more integrations into the operating system as well. It's a really quick way of getting to your Bing Chat or your AI tool, but then it also has integrations in Windows 11 where you can ask it to do some basic tasks right now, like open application, change your dark mode and change your setting. Uh, Windows 11 Copilot starts to show the integration that AI tools can have on a desktop as well as a web browser experience as well. You can also access Microsoft Copilot through copilot.microsoft.com. So even if you have a Mac, you can get access to some, but not all of these tools. The big one that we've all been waiting for is Microsoft 365 Copilot that started rolling out in November of 2023. I think when most people think of uh, Copilot, they think of the ads they've seen around Copilot in the Office Suite. So that's Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, and more. And this is where I believe the majority of people will want access to Microsoft 365 Copilot. Right now it is rolling out to a limited number of customers and organizations, but it will of course become more widespread as the adoption and demand increases. Microsoft 365 Copilot will change the way people work within the Office Suite and it's set to unlock new ways of working as it allows you to do so much more with the data and the information you have, not just in the program, but as it gives you access to your entire tenancy and it really brings AI insights into everyday workflow. Microsoft 365 Copilot starts at $30 USD per user per month on top of your M365 subscription. Uh, but of course, there are still some requirements your organization needs to meet before you can access Microsoft 365 Copilot right now. Also in November 2023, Microsoft released Microsoft Copilot Studio. This is a low code tool that allows you to customize Microsoft Copilot for 365, as well as build standalone applications. It brings together a set of powerful conversational capabilities from custom GPTs to generative AI plugins to manual topics, and it enhances your ability to build low code and no code applications for your organization. Microsoft Copilot Studio is really designed to give power to regular people where they can use low code, no code applications to build bespoke solutions inside of their organization, inside of their tenancy. This video turned out to be a lot longer than I expected, just simply giving you an overview of all the different co-pilots that have been released this year. And of course, I did use Copilot to help write the script for it. One tip I would give you or one caution I would give is that even though these products are amazing, you have to double check the work. There were several times when it was pulling information and giving it to me that really wasn't quite accurate. So a lot of it was great, but a lot of it like getting specific dates and specific information wasn't actually on point. So as amazing as these tools are, make sure you always have that last check of the information that it gives you because they may just pull the wrong bit of information as it compiles everything together. Overall though, I'm really excited about these Microsoft Copilot products. Hopefully this video gives you a better understanding about all the different AI tools Microsoft is bringing to the market. If you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up. If you're going to supercharge the way your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.